Uh, DePaul women's basketball doesn't tip off the regular season until November 6th. This Sunday, though, they'll take the courts inside a football stadium. Yeah, against the sport's best player for a worthy cause. Chris Bowden has more on the Blue Demons trip to Iowa City to face Caitlin Clark. When DePaul and eventual national runner-up Iowa played a highly competitive scrimmage a year ago here at McGrath Phillips Arena, barely anyone was there to see it. But Sunday, more than 50,000 tickets have been sold for the crossover at Kinnick Stadium, the Hawkeyes football home. After the game, Coach Bluter and I were just talking and said it's a shame nobody saw this. And I think that little germination of coach talk after the game sent Coach Bluter to the thought process of let's try to put this out in the football field. Well, I'm really excited to have this opportunity this early to play and really see what our team is made of, but also on a stage this big, I mean, it plays such significance in, in the growth of women's basketball, so I'm really honored to be a part of it. I was so excited when I heard about it. We were in the locker room, actually, as a team, and the news came out, and we all started jumping up and down and screaming, because this is just a great experience for women's basketball, for fans, you know, just women's sports in general. So we're all really excited, and we're amped up to play Iowa and Caitlin Clark. The adoration for National Player of the Year, Caitlin Clark, surely helps in shattering the 21-year-old women's attendance record of 29,000 for the national championship at San Antonio's Alamo Dome. But proceeds benefit neighboring Stead Children's Hospital. And just like it's done during football games, there will be a Hawkeye wave between participants and fans inside the stadium with patients and families looking down on them next door. It just shows how being a part of a sports team, being a part of athletics, you're a part of something bigger than yourself and how um, you make such an impact on others and others can impact you. I'm really excited to be a part of that tradition. I think I'll have goosebumps. I have goosebumps just talking about it, you know. Um, and it just makes you thankful for what you have when you see people fighting, you know, health issues that they can't control, especially young children with their whole life ahead of them. Um, it's really inspiring and I, I can't wait for us to, to be a part of it. And it looks like Mother Nature is going to cooperate with a forecast calling for overcast skies, 50 degrees and no rain, to avoid having to move the event indoors for those who bought rain or shine tickets to Carver Hawkeye Arena. Covering DePaul, Chris Bowden, WGN News.